ignore the black screen, y'all. I didn't realize the thing was on the fritz. So today we're going to be into tech it, tech it, whatever it is, technic, technic, tech, 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 oh my god, I can't speak. Technic, tech, technic, right there. So, uh, ooh, that's an old uh, eight track cassette tape. I know what those are. Today I'm going to be doing Millionaire. It is French, and it is supposed to be as historically accurate to 11th century civilizations as possible. There's not many. And I know the guy's still trying to um, update them, so yeah. Here we go. <sighs> hey, yeah. Before y'all ask, yeah, this is the only way I'm able to play Minecraft, the actual Minecraft game on this computer. <laughs> it's unplayable. It lags too bad. But this is, uh, this is, Technic is a nice alternative. So, I mean, it's better than nothing. So I'm trying to keep my voice down because my stepdad's having to make a ton of business calls and I don't want to interrupt him. So, uh, yeah. Let the games begin. Red Creator, evening, he says. Actually, Red, it's 11 in the morning for me. Is it like 11 at night for you or something? Mm. Yeah, keep calm and drink water. Preferably cold water. Yeah, Mr. Minecraft, what's up, what's up? Oh, man. I just, I need a minute, y'all. <laughs> I just remember this music from the game. It'd be nice if Mojang would re-release the like the latest update with like the music you would have heard throughout the game in like 1.7.2 or something. Because I remember the soundtrack from back then. <clears throat> All right, Mr. Minecraft. Say, so, Mr. Minecraft, if you play Java Minecraft, do you know how to set a server up? <laughs> Yes, Baraka's gone, sadly. I'm sorry. But the reason for that is obvious. There wasn't an actual village. There was like one village building and that was it. This is a full-fledged village. So, yeah. As you can see, the main problem with the streaming on my phone is there's a glare. Let me fix that. Uh, despite it being cloudy, this is also a good walking bench. I think I know what I might do sooner I'm done with this stream It'll be nice yeah and I've already started the trading as evidence by the gold the, the uh, copper and the silver <coughs> see I don't know what I'll use the slab path for so I need to get them red carpet white carpet iron wool White banner, bookshelves, cauldron, all of the woods, I know that much. Okay, so let's see, let me put you all up here. Got some gold, silver, and copper, but these are the actual names of the currency. Let me turn the volume down. I'll give, I forget the guy who composed the uh, music for Minecraft, but he did a great job, and actually, the soundtrack has a kind of nostalgic feel, really, for players who played the game in its infancy and have then come back now, ten years later. <laughs> I have no doubt it brings some kind of nostalgia, because I remember playing the game early on in its life. Like, 1.7 point, I think, 2 and 3 were the main versions I remember playing with. <laughs> I wonder, Mr. Minecraft, has C418 actually done any other soundtracks since the game i'm curious about that because <laughs> i have no him on the map as far as being a, as far as being like a major musician or musical composer goes but i mean his music's what also gives the game character and it's actually what even gives it a sense of uh timelessness if you know what i mean which you know, it's a nice thing. Because keep in mind, I was only like, what, 12, 13 when, this, when I started playing? And here I am almost 19 coming back. Really for nostalgia's sake. And I love it. <clears throat> now, where are those 
banners. Because I, I, I want to go on and get these. See, there's 16 banners. Alright, I need to see what else did they want. See, there's all the wood. I need to get cobblestone and stone. So put you all up here. There we are. Let's see, stone. Oh, that's not it. Nope, 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 no, nope, no. Nope. Don't need that. That's from a tiger bomb. And cobblestone. There we go. I need to get myself some cobblestone. I need to get some glass too. I might get a metric ton of glass while I'm here. There we are. Now what I'm doing is I'm storing all this stuff in my inventory so that I have it in advance. Let's see, I know there's cauldrons. Isn't there cauldrons? Yeah, of course there's cauldrons. Oh, I need to get carpet. I think it's red, white, and yellow, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, you can hear them out there working. Let's see, food. No, no. There it is. Oh, God, you can hear them all out there working. Cauldron. That. Oh, let me put those up here. There we are. So as you can tell, I'm getting them everything they're needing, supply-wise. But now we're getting into the millionaire, to millionaire modded blocks. So you can see what I'm doing. I'm getting all the blocks that are already in-game first. And I might even give them a metric ton of iron. Boys, we about to make them go into the Iron Age. Get out of my way and watch this. They want iron. Oh, I'll give them iron. Like, four freaking stacks worth. <laughs> hey, I'm a generous guy. I don't mind. Now, what are these? So, they need these. Okay. So, they need the, they need the timber frame. So, this is like what you would have seen in England at around the time period that they're depicting in here, which is the 11th century. And that sort of architectural style still exists today, believe it or not, as far as for, I think, ornate uses are concerned. <clears throat> oh. Well, you know, you'd think he would do something, surely. Alright, there's the millionaire. Oh, that's their content creators. I do need that. Alright, there's the timber frames. Now, what else is it that they need? Is that the stained glass? Oh, yeah, this is all stained glass. Oh, my goodness. I'll need to look at these myself soon. Oh, wow. God, these windows. These are pretty. So now, as you can see, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to hold shift. As you can see, I've basically given them a metric ton of stuff. And this is the village, and as you can see, I've marked it a beacon. I put a beacon up so they know, so I know where it is. <laughs> I'm surprised that the guy who's made the mod doesn't have, like, one of them be like a miner. You know, have one guy come down here mine and another come down here to protect the guy. You've got all the outbuildings here and then you've got the main building, which is this huge wooden one here.
And as you can see what I've done there is I've given them a hell of a lot of building materials. And I've also crashed the game. <laughs> I've also crashed the game. That's funny. Well. Well, that's an issue. <laughs> I think. Uh. Uh oh. Yeah, that's an issue. Hold on, everybody. I, I broke the game. <laughs> yeah, let me, let me just re-log. That probably would help. No, I might look. It won't save any progress, but it's better than nothing. Yeah, that's a common issue with this, with, on this Acer now. And it happened even on the Toshiba where the game would just freeze at random. So, uh, yeah. Also, I lost the orca photo that I had as the the background. Oh well. You can see the cultures that we're adding in. <clears throat> wow, is there really only one person? Oops. I think half blocks. Dear God, that's nightmare fuel. Uh oh. Uh oh, what? Oh God. <laughs> Scared the bejesus out of me. Okay, good. All of that mess made it through. Thank God for that. <clears throat> Yeah, basically who I'm looking for is the guy who's the main person who's in charge, but I don't know. But as you can see here, they're using those materials to build a new um, house here, which is nice. Yeah, because I remember, I think the music was actually... Or a bit more, I guess you could say, unique. Oh, we have a merchant. Yeah, you can see here. solved. <laughs> oh, he's the mer- so that's the- 
So this is the guest room. That's interesting. One thing I've wanted to do is multiplayer, but I can't since you guys see the servers are lag lag and they crash the game, but I mean Jesse and I have somehow managed it once. There we are, good sir. There we are. Bailiff, so he's like the uh... oh, I oh yeah, I forgot you could make them build like huge things. You <laughs> see him all talking. Just kills him. No, I'm just kidding. Oh! Mate, you need a better axe. Now I'm thinking about, I'm curious about this. Why is this guy all the way out here? Let's over him before you I will. It seriously like a Alright. Alright, lads. I'm back. I broke a back to the British. It's alright, Mr. Minecraft. Let me see what the progress is. I know one thing. I know you can make these villages, like, huge. If I'm not mistaken. Just goes and just takes everything.
This is where I'm just going to start trying to basically get everything. <laughs> you can hear the ice just... Bubbling it all. <laughs> Me and the boys out here basically taking everything and giving it to them. Basically, I'm doubling all of their stuff. I'm just out here giving them everything. I'm stronger than I look. Oh dear. The colonies need stone, and they're gonna get more stone than they know what to do with. <laughs> I'm churning out a lot more building materials than any of them know what to do with. I'm just here basically flooding all over their chest for building material. Get him a metric kind of carpet. About to give them more iron than they know what to even do with. <laughs> I am basically <laughs> the economy needs stone exactly red. Met <laughs> One metric ton of building materials later. <laughs> It's like two trillion tons of building materials later. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, that's great. Let's see. I need to get them bookshops. I want to expand their knowledge. I'm like a priest. I'm here to convert them. No, I'm just kidding. Don't do that. That's really bad. Everyone has their own religions. Respect them. I am building. I will give you everything. <laughs> How to get rich quick. <laughs> <laughs> right now I'm going to get more wood than I even know what to do with. <laughs> Coal. Why not? Time set day, you fools! <laughs> I'm out here.
Oh my god. Yeah, I think I've given them more than enough building material. <laughs> I'm going to just start building, having... Yeah, you can see... Me and the boys out here just improving these villagers' lives by basically flooding their village with more materials than they could ever dream of. And I mean, look at the landscape, too. The landscape is beautiful. I mean, look at this. You got mountains, you got rivers, you got plains. It's, it's, it, it, it's, it's beautiful. You got forests, too. The only thing I ever added was the beacon. That was literally it. Oh, and I refilled their well, too. This thing was near empty when I was here last. And I put beacons in it as well. They need to have a fence around this. People can go and trample the crops. And they've got more saplings than they know what to do with. Let me see if I can get him a new axe. I don't like that he's having to use a wooden axe. I have no f doubt that is not exactly. Let's see. Let's see. Oh, well, they have Inuit. Uh, oh, yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, the Inuits, they still exist. I know for a fact. I think them or their descendants still exist out in Alaska and in the Arctic. I mean, don't quote me on that. <laughs> don't they have, like... There we go. Tools. So evident, I guess they use their thing as a battle axe. Alright, I want to see if I can get this guy... Let's see, there's got to be a way for me to get him his, a new axe. I guess I'll have to wait for his axe to break, I guess. I mean, use wood tools. I hope... I want to wait for their stuff to break so I can go on and give them the iron stuff, really. Yeah, here we go. I'm going to duplicate the living hell out of these. This is not communism. This is called progress, comrade.
when you literally throw money away just to get more stuff. Oh crap, the stream froze. I'm so sorry, y'all. I didn't realize. Sorry, I crashed the game. <laughs> There's just too many people. Yeah, my grandmother's coming to get me at 1.30, with it, which is within the hour. I need to get dressed and all that. Because all I'm wearing is some uh, gym shorts, undergarments, and a shirt. That's literally it. So I need, to, I need to get all this mess packed up as well. So I'll uh, see y'all later, I suppose.